So I'm headed out. I'm on my way to change the world along with other people. Although, I keep thinking about this change the world thing and going, I would rather have this be a demonstration of the ways in which I have changed myself. And so I have made some food while I was broadcasting on DS106 radio. And I'm going to go down, pick up my ukulele that's been in the shop for the last three days. And I'm going to play some music in the park for the people that are talking about ways in which they've changed themselves too. Or ways they would like to. You know, by taking back public space, I think we're also taking back public thought. An occupation of a space is, you know, kind of our way of... It, it's a way of confronting the occupation of the mind that happens. It's interesting when you're a part of a group like this. You never really know why other people are motivated to be here, except that you can sense some kind of a longing, a longing to participate in something that's not necessarily the same old system. No locks on the dumpsters. There's food in there. It's a hunger for something different. And people that come down here, I think, are ready to accept the possibility of an alternate existence. How cool would it be if, like, you could camp out in the middle of downtown anytime you wanted? Uh, the Outwater Market is at the Unel Group Metro. Um, and if you go there uh, between 5 30 and 6 every day, I'm not sure about Sundays, but I suspect probably also Sundays. Uh, you, if you go to the east side of the whole market, where there's there's all the bins and everything, there's a guy who rounds up all the all the vegetables that the people aren't selling because it's like a, a rich kind of a dick market sort of, and uh, so they don't sell anything that has any blemishes on it. And so from 5:30 to 6, you can just take whatever they want before they take it away. What's 